And this is the uh, penultimate set of the tournament, but potentially, potentially we might have one more. We could have a reset. It is possible, right, but it's on. Good. good to see how it goes. MZ Ultra versus Steven, Luchas Finals. Now this matchup, once again, I still see this could be in Puff's favor, given the fact that Puff's hitboxes are relatively small compared to Luffy's, but Luffy taking it. The first stock. Oh, that what kill? a rest. Oh, that that kill. killed? What? We didn't even get to see it kill. I didn't even see what per second was that. He just he died. Was at, he was at 49. He was at 49. This game sucks. <laughs> Man. Alright, well, already even stocks in just the first minute of the game. In the first minute, like... Just the immediate arrest to counter, just dying super early to that stomp. Just showing that, hey, you kill me early, I'll kill you early too. So like, it's just like, alright, I'll just swing. This is what's happening now. Ultra's just swinging to cover himself because Puff's movement in the air is so good at just reaching Luffy. Yeah, so MG is just throwing out a ton of like Nair and up air, which are definitely like the tools you you probably want to throw them out the most in this matchup just because they cover the most space. So. Yeah. Because like Luffy's uh, moves on the ground aren't exactly like that good for covering space just because they cover like a really weird area. Like exactly. tilt isn't exactly like an ideal anti air just because it hits because it's super thin and it hits like it doesn't hit like straight above him. Yeah. And up smash has an incredibly huge uh, perk box extension, so throwing that out is incredibly risky. It hits in the weirdest ways. Oh, that spike should be. This should be good damage. Yep, Down the air, stomp, up smash. Up smash. Yeah. yeah, Luffy's up smash is normally like below average in strength against most characters, but against floaties, against it can top. kill uh, decently early, which yep, is something that Steven will damage. have to worry about. Can't be just throwing out moves when up smash can just kill you extremely early. Wait, but what was that? Was time, Nair? Yeah, his Nair got clipped by back air. Oh. That is the danger of uh, throwing out moves because his hurtbox extends so widely. So you're just yeah. going to get clipped a lot. You're going to get clipped a lot. Nice rollout somehow working. This game is awesome. Like, yeah. this is just good positioning from... All right. This is good positioning back from throw, Ultra. That's, smash. that's gonna be it. Yeah, you gotta tech those back throws. You, gotta tech. you could just... Uh, like, if you want to, like, Luffy can just, like, grab you over and over. And if you don't tech it, like, back throw can just loop into itself. Or just yeah, combo into up smash if he wants to. I saw he was getting a lot of back throws into up down smash because no one was teching it. But last set, you you was get the down back throw is getting teched a lot, so yeah. Yeah, back throw down smash is only really like uh, good uh, if you like know they're not gonna tech or they're only gonna like tech in. Yeah. But we just saw that. Just saw that we was just teching out. All right, now no edge guard just rushing straight to center stage. Ultra yeah, is in a very the comfortable edge guarding position. versus Puff isn't exactly good. Although, I guess nope. to be fair, most characters can't exactly edge guard Puff easily because of how uh, yeah. mobile he is. But Luffy, ex especially, isn't like that strong. Like, you've got yeah. forward air, you've got uh, side B. Like, the Ooh, problem is they don't have a lot of priority on them. And yeah. again, with side B, there is a possibility that you'll just get clipped out of it. So. Yeah, like, there is like, an inherent risk out. to trying to actually edge guard him with your tools. Puff can just beat out a lot of his moves because there's not really like much, if not any, priority. So he's like, alright, I'll just throw out an air or a back air. That'll probably beat out what you're throwing out. Yeah, Puff can just kind of throw aerials with little risk because uh, if uh, MG tries to counter poke, uh, they're going to stuff them out. And if he respects it, like... Uh, He's not going to get much from uh, how far away he has to poke him out. Yeah. Right, this is just going. And the, Ooh, rest, the rest. I don't what know. You, nope, I did kill. not kill. Why did you do that? I think he's just going on it just for the mental damage. Like, you got rested and yeah, I didn't kill, but you just let that happen to you. 
you no, want to hold that? Pico. Why did you just pop the gif as soon as you see the rest? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it just... True. Yeah, it, it doesn't matter if it kills. Arrest is arrest. True. Even if it doesn't kill, rest is rest. That should be... Real. Shout out to him not killing Amsa and losing. Yep, this is just going. This is just throwing out a bunch of hitboxes that we were seeing earlier yeah. from yeah. Puff. Luffy's just getting just super stuffed out right now. He can't really deal with uh, Puff just getting in on his face when he doesn't want it. Yeah, Puff is just able to just throw out a bunch. Ooh, that back air. Taking it. A stock lead, a singular stock lead. That should be Ode up smash whiffing. This is just yeah, even out. against Puff, uh, Luffy's kill power is still rather it's still, average. It's, really, it's still bad. It's still and bad. And again, but... since you can't cobble Puff, but racking up damage Ooh, is hard. Right, right into that the was grab. That was a great uh, grab out of the rollout. So. It's not that good. Please stop using it. I don't know. Ooh, I think he's just using it just because they're letting him get away with it. No, even though I... they should be. This shouldn't. That could have been a rest earlier and taking the stock off MD, but it wasn't trying to risk it. Right now, this is just like, all right, I'm just, just throwing up a bunch of hit boxes from Steve and just like, I'll throw out a fair, a nair, or a back air. You're not gonna be able to punish it, so you just have to deal with it. See the yeah, back I'm air. I'm noticing that Steve in that right now is like going in a lot more, and he's not going for like aggressive raids uh, from the last set. Yeah, he's like, alright, I'll just throw. I'm just, I'm gonna just keep pressing you. But he's Steven going in and rushing that. down MGU incredibly well, and he's not just going for like hard read F smashes or stuff like that uh, compared to his yeah. Billy, which I Man, definitely so feel like is the move. Agree, especially against if you, Luffy. even against Luffy, if you mess up the read, you are going to get hit hard. Exactly, especially as Puff, that ki oh, that's dead. Oh, that's dead, uh, yep. Alright, Steven tying up games. Steven tying up the set, 1-1. One, one. Just showing a difference in that first game. He's like, alright, the adaptations are coming in. Not fully okay. adapted, but they're coming in. Uh, Battlefield, I the Luffy yeah, counter, the yeah, Luffy counter pick. A good pick sure. The Luffy counter pick, man. The up airs will be very good against Puff. Um, yeah, it's definitely a good juggling tool versus Puff because it's just because it's pretty. It hits high up, and yeah. it's like not exactly like, strong enough to kill, but not strong enough to like like keep you uh, like nowhere. Exactly. Like, it's a good balance between. Like, Ooh, didn't pop it. They didn't pop it. Come on, be <laughs> sad time speaker. Bruh. How are you out of them? How, are, how do you how run out of How do you run out? Each box has so many. Each box has so many. How are you out? <laughs> two years. Uh, two, two years. Jesus. Like, like, every year there's like 500 updates to it. Come on, man. Up. Oh, okay, the missing the rest. The punish. Oh, the punish. Underwhelming punish. Underwhelming punish. All right, let's see. Is he gonna try and challenge it? Nope, failed. He tried to challenge it, but he failed. And he still got hit by it. This is some extreme gameplay right now. Nice, oh, nice back air. Nice back Actually, air. Nice back air. Decently early. But once again, like MGU is still at a slight disadvantage. You with the you with the rest punish, man. You lost. You lost the mental battle. Like right now, you're just like, all right. That rest punish nope. is gonna live rent free in your head now. Ooh, that's gonna be damage. All right, well, nice that's tech read. About the most damage he's actually gotten versus Puff in one interaction. Yeah, because right now Steven's just playing so good to avoid getting extremely blown up by MGU, and this is just going well. Yeah, MGU is still, like kind of struggling at actually dealing with Steven getting in. Yeah, so like with Steven, Puff, you're not exactly yeah. used to, like you're not exactly used to Puff like uh, getting into playing aggressive. You're mostly used to like 
watching Puff just like uh, weave in and out, just playing like kind of hit and run because you're, you're used to hugging her box. approach is like completely in the air, and like her approach yeah. is gonna be super predictable. So if but you, you got a like, really good rounds. disjoint, you can easily shut her down. Yeah, and her grounded Ground game is those. really bad, so she pretty much has to be in the air if she wants to play effectively. But yep. MQ isn't really like uh, trying too hard to swat her out, so. She's you just can't really, because uh, your moves are just gonna lose the puffs. So. And even then, they're just so linear. Puffs movement allows it to just weave in between those hitboxes, regardless of how large yeah, they are. Oh, probably gonna kill here. Yep. Yep. That's probably the perfect percent. I think like any late earlier wouldn't have killed. Yep. Yeah, this is just going now. MG uses like, alright. I can just keep stuffing you out with nares. Getting my extreme. Oh! Alright, side that... B, side B. Alright, that's. Alright. Yeah, it feels like it's been going super back and forth, but it feels like Steven has been mostly, like, uh, taking the upper hand in most of these interactions. Yeah. I feel like MG could try and, like, uh, bait uh, his approaches more. Yeah, Although with Luffy, like... it is kind of hard to do that because he doesn't have, like, an option that's, like, super scary. Yeah, the main like, option uh, that would be quote unquote scary is like side B or Nair, but that's not that scary for Puff. Yeah, Nair is like, like they're not even, it's not even that they're not scary. It's that like he uses them all the time in neutral. It's not like, uh, yeah, say, it's, like it's a nothing, Zangief SPD. Yeah. Like uh, you just throw that out and oop, you just took a huge amount of damage and you're going to get. Uh, exactly. Oop, oop. Like uh, with Nair, like. Like, since it's your primary tool, it's going to get really linear. And side B uh, is super laggy, so if you miss it, you're probably going to die. You're probably just going to die. Like, this this is what I think is the problem with Luffy, especially what MG Ultra has been doing, is his playstyle is becoming a lot more linear, that if you actually just paid attention for a while, you'd just be able to catch on. And that's what Steven's doing. It's like, alright, I know you're just going to press these hitboxes in this position, See, right now, he's like, all right, I know you're going to try an up air or a nair. See? Waiting on the platform for the up air. So now he's like, all right, I can just stay in that zone. I know where your hitboxes are coming from. Yeah, and it feels like yeah, he's definitely, here. like, downloaded MG after the first game. Yeah. It's just okay. like, I know where you are going to be and how you're going to do it. So I'm just like, all right, I can just play it like that. But yeah, he just even knows that, what yeah, MG is just gonna do because he's just been throwing it out so frequently without really mixing up his game plan. It's no mix-ups. It's just one linear game plan that he has, and it's just working out. Because what else he, does he have? So that yeah, linear like, game even, plan is trying to get punished. Yeah, even then, like Steven doesn't really have to mix up his game plan because MG isn't mixing up his. Because like. If I'm doing this and it's working, why should I change it up? Why should I change it? If it has, if it, if it works, don't fix it. Like right now, that side B, trying to get an extension with that side B with a get up attack. This is just now the back throw. Ooh, the nair. All right, this could, this could be a stop. This could be a stop. Ooh, uh, Smash, not gonna get it. So, not gonna get also uh, has a sweet spot, so. Like, all of nice. the Ooh, that that's nice. were really reliable. I am oh, the that's rest. Raw. <laughs> that's raw. That is so yeah, raw for that rest. Steven telling was... uh, MGU that he is him. That was such a raw rest. Just being like, I, I'm just the him. Bed. I am him. I'll just get this rest now. MGU is going to have to make quite a statement to get the comeback. Game 4. One, with a uh, rest punish, and then you got rested twice in the same game, I think that's going to be a lot of mental damage in Steven's favor. Like, I, I would definitely be tilted. Like, I would not want to hold... I would I would want my revenge. Like, you like, can't just let that happen to you and just move on with it. Yeah, you can't just move on. Like, you got rested twice in a single game. That's going to hurt. I don't know what stage MGU would want to go on for game four. I definitely it, could see a run back, but maybe uh, like Yoshi's. I, just, I could see like a Yoshi's. 
Yeah, either Yoshi's or Battlefield would probably be what he'd want to go. You want to try and kill Puff early, because MD, MD wasn't getting many kills at early percents. Yeah, but because also MGU was just losing neutral. Yeah, I, but I think it's just due to the fact his neutral has just become so predictable. So it's not yeah, like he's just kind of running around, throwing out Nair, sometimes throwing out Side B. He's not like... Like, I haven't like seen him play a grounded game a whole lot. It's mostly just been, like, running up in Nair. And well, while Luffy's ground moves yeah. aren't exactly good, like, you still have them. Exactly. And you'd want to make advantage of it. You want to use your grounded moves. Because, like, adding that layer with grounded moves would allow your playstyle to become less predictable and be like, okay... I can, my opponent's gonna start thinking, will my opponent approach from the air or from the ground? But because you're only solely approaching from the air, they're like, okay, I'll just have to stay out of that aerial range that they have with Nair and Side B. And that's what Steven's been doing. Yeah, it does kind of become a problem when you're playing a character who just has like a, a horrendous ground game like Puff, because her grounded moves are just so bad, so there's literally no merit to using them at all. But her air moves are, like, pretty above average, so I guess it compensates. Anyways, uh, taking the run back to Battlefield, I definitely uh, would understand this choice, but I probably would go for, like, Yoshi's unless Steven banned that, which I definitely uh, would do that. So Yoshi's is not a favorable stage for Puff, especially in this yeah. matchup where Luffy can just cover more space with his uh, disjoints, or not yeah. disjoints. I wouldn't be surprised if it was banned. I wouldn't be surprised. Steven's like, okay, I don't want to go to Yoshi's, so I'll just ban it and just go wherever. Because wherever else is comfortable for Puff. Because right oh, now... Didn't go for the rest feel... there. I, If he went for he the should... rest there, I, I would have won. Yeah, well, you should have just, you should have just went for the rest, be raw, man. Like, after that, like, after that rest in the last game, you gotta be feeling yourself. Like, you definitely go for it, even if it, even if it misses, like, you went for it. Like, yes. that, that's exactly. just making a statement. And also, the rest punishes have been, remember that rest punish MG Ultra miss? He's gonna still replay, so he's like, alright, if he whiffs this rest, I need to get this punish. And then there's going to add an extra layer of nerves, like, oh, what if I miss it again? Yeah, I think the other issues that, like, oh, I got the putters, but, like, what can I get off of it? Can't combo puff that well. Exactly. Yeah, unless you're at, like, a really, unless puffs at a super high percent, most of the time, like, you don't exactly have to be too worried about whiffing a rest, because, yeah, you're good, it's going to hurt, but, like, at yeah, the worst, right. you'll take minor damage and just go into disadvantage. You probably Although just I guess like depending 30%. on the character, it could be like um, a lot worse like against Fox because you could I'm against just, Fox like, you could you an and then stock. just it smashes you at 40 and you're dead. It could be an entire stock against Fox, but against someone like Luffy, it could be at most like 20 to 30 percent. Because yeah, with uh, Luffy, Luffy he's not gonna rack up a huge amount of percent. So. He doesn't have that many good combos against Puff like that. See that side B again. If he was more of a grounded approach, you would have got it. Alright, that up smash should take it. it. MG playing a bit stronger this this game. The uh at least he's not doing the same predictable I'll be doing there as much. It's still being done, but not as much. And it's yeah, I think he's the, like uh, gotten a bit better at mixing up his approach because he's realizing, oh, he knows when I'm gonna do this. Maybe I should do this to throw him off. Exactly. So right now, you see that side, that near side B again. But instead of the, these recoveries have been working out in MGO's favor by just going extremely high. Because Steven is expecting a low recovery that he can just punish. See that high recovery again, no air dodge. Yeah, Puff recover, Puff isn't exactly good at dealing with high recovery because she doesn't have the vertical ability to actually Ooh, deal so, that down so most of the time good. you're better off just going for against mid or low recoveries yeah but yeah it's more like yeah you don't have many good punishes against high recoveries but like your opponent knows that too so you should be able to like just be like, right, they're probably going to go high yeah i guess that's Stephen what... is just like all right well I'll let this rock because i know i'm just gonna beat him in neutral yeah 
But right now, MD Ultra with a, a pretty good lead, not taking much damage on this stock and trying to get some extra credit. Yeah, but just like that, it, it could definitely, uh, that lead could just go away in a matter of seconds because with a lucky rest. One lucky rest is all it takes. Not this percent, but a little bit more percent and this stock is gone. Yeah, I guess it's just about like Steven uh, trying to see if like, is it worth taking the risk to go for rest and get a killer? Can I win neutral? No oh, oh no, yep, there was a rest. Right there. Not right there, but and that's dead. Uh, that's that's dead. unfortunate. So, we go to game five. I guess I spoke too soon stuff. about like the comeback. Nah, you were right. The rest was just placed in the wrong time. Yeah. He definitely uh, could have. Uh, I think he was expecting MG to just throw out something and then he'd go for the rest to try and clip it, but uh, it didn't end up happening. So he then just he just died for it. He just chose to disengage and then got punished for it. Yeah, MG could definitely. Yeah, MG's been playing a lot better with uh, his uh, neutral. Although it's yeah. still uh, like a bit hard versus Puff because. Again, your main tools are just going to get beaten out so much. Exactly. And uh, MG oh. choosing... Uh, or Steven choosing Rainbow Rock. Steven choosing here. Now, last time we saw this stage, it almost went to time, and that was in when his finals. Could Steven be trying to go for that kind of strategy again? But it doesn't look like it. A very aggressive start. I mean, I can definitely see him going for a timeout on this stage, because Luffy doesn't really have the ability or kill power to actually, like, uh, try and stop Puff from going for a timeout, but at the same time, like, uh, that's assuming, yeah. like, uh, they both have the mental energy to actually go for a timeout. Yeah, we are in like, game Steven, five, uh, losers finals, and plus Steven MG could, also like, didn't try and go, so long. Like, he could be like, yeah, I could type out. That would take a while, but I could do it. But also, yeah. like, I could just, like, play the game normally and just uh, force them to just play my game. Exactly. Like, uh, These rollouts have not been getting punished by MG. Yeah, he's been going to get super high to avoid, like, uh, actually just uh, getting hit by him. Even though yeah, this... uh, you can't cancel it, like, uh, you have to deal with uh, Rollout having surprisingly good mobility, and if it hits, it will kill you. It will kill. One thing also is this stage, extremely high ceiling, is allowing for Steven to live a lot later, but that back air closing it out. MGU is going to struggle to land the hits that he needs to get this kill because Puff has so much more movement options with these platforms. Yeah, so I like that Steven really knows uh, when it's a good time to disengage. Like He just uh, played aggressively for a few seconds and then immediately disengaged because he realized that MG was going to try and go for something to get the kill. But right yeah. now, it feels like MG is just like trying to dance around everything so much. Just because he wants that kill, but uh, he doesn't know what he's going to do. So he's just like trying to outmaneuver him. That should be a punish. And so far, it hasn't been working. Yeah, it's not been working out. And oh, that's dead. Yeah, the 180%. It's a better rough start better. for MG because he can't kill Puff but easily, even with the. Uh, like his range exactly it, you just gotta like hope you guys uh, get a few meaningful stray hits so. you gotta but with the loopy like he doesn't have the mobility or Ooh, that should be dead he doesn't have the mobility to actually keep up with puff so she could just move around the stage as much as she wants and uh, and she exactly. can't really do anything about it so. she's just free to do whatever she needs to which is extremely interesting in a matchup like this, like the range versus the mobility becomes an actual question. What matters more? Because right now you can see the mobility of Puff is being extremely important. Because Luffy may have the range, but his range doesn't matter because he can just move around him. Yeah, that and also even with the range, like Luffy's punish is not going to be too strong in this matchup. So you just gotta get like a good strong hit to, to either uh, give you positional advantage or uh, put Steven in a bad spot. Woody down air up smash taking it though. And this could be doable for MG, but he's gotta put in a lot more 
and Steven. Yeah, this this matchup seems like there's a lot of work for very little reward. The most I've seen him get off a of punish is like 40. Right now, that's just not enough against Puff. Because living to a... Oh, that's a, oh that could have been a rest. Yeah, most of Luffy's yeah. punish excels when he's fighting fast fighters, but against more floaty characters, it can crumble pretty fast. Ooh. And the hurt box clipping right there. The hurt box clip. MG on his tournament stock is going to have to put in a, an insane oh, amount of work to make this uh, comeback. There's basically no extra credit on this stock. So right now, Steven is free to do whatever he pleases. So you can just go for whatever YOLO option. Yeah. Even a random rest right now. Because I, this is just the situation that we have. The forwarder is not going to take it. Yeah, it looks like MG's panicking. He's just throwing out moves hoping they'll hit because he just wants to just stay just in. Wants, he just wants to stay in. He's like, I made it to game five. I can do this. Regardless of the fact, he's like, okay, it doesn't matter what happens. Yeah, he's, he's been getting outplayed so much. Like, even then, like, uh, when you're at this point, you kind of start to get desperate. So I can definitely, like, understand why MG's doing this. Yeah, like I you want to that. you want to win you want to you want to make that comeback when you've gotten this far you but got this just far. struggling uh, like he's uh, he can't uh, really stop steven from getting in that should be dead there it is this is doable but it's gonna be it's a lot doable, of work but uh, it's, it's steven too much could just work. get like one good uh momentum one shift good, and one all of a sudden uh, mg's just gone yeah like, there's like an 80% deficit, percent deficit, so... It's I'm just gonna have to win neutral a lot to even up the percentages. And winning neutral with Luffy that much is just highly unlikely. Yeah, especially with a character as uh, m as mobile and floaty as Puff. Yep, and that that's gonna do Stephen. it. Stephen, Stephen takes it in a Game 5 set. 3-2. Might got, like... That was a lot slower of a game, but... Like I said, the movement that Puff gets on that stage allows her to potentially go for time, if needs be. Yeah. But now Puff can definitely play on a slower pace on that stage because, like, the upper blast zone is so high and the, the inverted uh, battlefield layout, like, you could move around a huge amount with the platforms, and like, Luffy just can't chase you because his mobility is just lacking compared to Puff. And even then, yeah. like, any of the moves he has that hits above him, like. You've got up air and up B, and that's really it. And even then, yeah. like, uh, you can just air dodge through both of those pretty easily. Exactly. So Steven is in grand finals for the reset against Billy. A very uh, interesting well, it's not going to be a reset, but we will see the run back from winner's finals. And